Hi there, welcome back to DMK Skoda in Wakefield. Today I'm going to be showing you around Yankee Yankee 69 November Alpha Oscar, which is of course this gorgeous Skoda Karok Scout. It's a 2 litre diesel, 158 horsepower manual, four wheel drive, and it's a fantastic car. And this gorgeous emerald green, as you can see, very nice colour, been very well looked after. I'm going to show you around it now, show you some of the features. We'll start with the 19 inch alloys. Nice five spoke design in great condition on all four corners and plenty of tread left on the tyres. Now these tyres are capable of taking you off road as well as on road comfortably so very very nice. You can see we've got chrome window surrounds matching the chrome roof bars. We've got nice silver uh, wing mirror covers there. Very nice. There is a panoramic sunroof on top which I shall show you once we step inside. Just a very nice car this. As you can see it's got a tow bar on the back that is removable. There's a whole kit for it. Four wheel drive badging there on the back. If I show you in the boot because it's electronically operated on this and you'll find the usual large boot in here you've got the shopping hooks that are adjustable and movable you've got the space saver spare wheel with all the bits with it underneath the floor you've got the removable torch here for added practicality and the 12 volt charger the very flex seats so each seat folds independently of one another and the nice parcel shelf that attaches to the tailgate very nice If I show you those rear seats, you'll find that being a Scout, you've got this lovely black and sort of brown accented cloth seats in the front and in the rear in great condition, barely been touched. As mentioned, they are ice fixed, so these straps, each seat has its own individual strap to allow independent movement from one another. Very nice. And they can also be removed should you want to. Uh, ice fix points on the left and right hand side. You've got the usual tables on the back of the seat in front. Very, very nice and handy. And another 12 volt charger there. As you can see, the panoramic glass extends to the back of the car as well, to the rear passengers. You've got this nice wood effect in all the doors as well. Just very stylish. For a 69 plate diesel, this is very low mileage at 16,031 miles. I'll show you that as we step inside. But then up front, you've got again, more silver accents there, nicely matching the wing mirrors and a half chrome grille. And of course, daytime running lights. Then of course, stepping inside again, you've got the lovely Scout lettering and the nice brown accented seats up front in great condition, both driver and front passenger. Again, more wood accents. And of course, these have the little LED lights that stretch through the doors as well, so you can have nice colours there too. Virtual cockpit in the centre, which shows that you have 16,031 miles on the clock. You can change how you view that in the centre and what you view in the centre, which is very, very nice, just with this view button here. So very, very nice there. You've got basic cruise control on the indicator stock. You've got voice control, volume, and song and radio selection. Wipers on the opposite side. Automatic lights with rear and front fogs here. And you've got the boot release here. Pull once and it opens. And what you do is you hold it and the boot will start beeping and it will also close. As soon as you let go, it will stop. So just keep holding it until you hear a click and it will close. Stop start control here. You've got keyless entry on the driver and front passenger doors. All electric windows and mirror adjustment, including electronic folding and heating. Infotainment wise, you've got the usual, you've got radio, you've got Bluetooth connectivity for your phone, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, satellite navigation as well, as mentioned voice control, you've got all around Parkinson's as well that you can bring up with the touch of this button or as you get closer to or behind uh, the vehicle there, and also if you put the car in reverse, you have a rear camera as well. Uh, only thing I will caution you is with the tow bar in, just be careful there with that extra distance there, obviously it doesn't account for that on the car. And then finally, you've also got drive mode select, including snow mode, so that helps with slippier surfaces in bad weather. Very nice. And also with this one, off-road mode, which gives you off-road capabilities, really. It's quite nice. Then air conditioning, you've got heated seats for the front two seats, dual climate control system, so they can be independent of one another. To bring back to the center, you just press sync and it will follow the drivers. Stop-start control, parking assist um, sensors, activation and deactivation, hazard lights, lock and unlock, Storage for your phone underneath this cover here, a USB port and the third and final 12 volt charger. Six speed manual gearbox, so a very economical and smooth gearbox, but also very powerful. Goes through all the gears lovely and reverses down, over and forward. Very nice. Electronic handbrake with auto hold function, obviously the off-road mode and mode select and traction control here. Storage as usual under here with the cup holders in this removable section there that doubles as a full cover or an adjustable reach and height armrest glove box wise you've got the usual glove box for the owner's manual on the air cool valve you've got the sd card for the satellite navigation and slot for another one for music and then finally to show you the roof we just pull this button back and it tips fully back and you can see here in this little separate button as well you press that 
and the screen will go forward as well so you can have it fully covered while letting a little bit of light in or just have it open and have all this headroom which is very very nice especially on weather like today so all in all this is a great car with very low mileage and well worth considering if you are interested please do feel free to visit Dembydale Road Wakefield WF2 7AW or alternatively give us a call on 01924 246 900 thank you very much for your time you take care now